Hello guys, welcome again. From this video, we are going to learn how we can create a setter injection and constructor injection concept in Spring. So in previous example, uh, if you have not seen, kindly watch these, those videos also. We have created a class here and we have the interface vehicle. So I'm creating, uh, the, I'm using the same class, but here I'm using some variable, I say, string name and i say string you say model of the car like this this is my property and i go to source and i say a generate getter and setter so i am just generating getter and setter just for a setter uh, injection and now uh, i'm using here to display information i say name equal to name of car equal to and i say here uh, name or i can say get name like this and i say one more thing uh, say the model model equal to plus get model like this so i just change the function now i have this one i create one more uh, first just i see the getter uh, setter one and then i will give you the constructor injection just i go to the xml file here now you see in previous video we have uh, seen this one but now under this bean tag i am using the property tag also property tag here i just give name name of the property is the uh, name itself and the value in the name is and uh, this is car i say maruti or honda kya uh, here the value of the car i say the honda city okay so this one the first value and the second value in property we have property name equal to and i say model and i give the value here the model is 2021 like this remember that i am giving here the property value and this is same the previous bean tag and i am in slicing the value of this property and i am using property tag sub tag under the beans this concept is called setter injection now how it will become setter injection uh, you see i just go to this and automatically i am calling this one if i will call this info again now if i run it and you see the honda car city and model is this is coming and i again go to this one and i just uh, use here comma also just for better you can see display save it go to this one and run it and you see that name of the car honda city and model is 2021 so it is coming and this concept simple concept nothing is special this time using here the property i am giving the value to the property and from this property i am initializing my uh, object of car so this is called the setter injection if i create one more class here for example i create new class and i say the bike here and again i implement this by using vehicle like this and i override the same method
I just copy from this this one and I just save this one and copy this one so here in place of this what I am using I am creating the variable string name and string uh, model again and but in place of property I am using here the constructor and I say string name string model and here I say uh, this dot name equal to name this dot model equal to model like this and here I am using the name I am here using the model same simple program nothing special but here here I am using constructor and from this XML file this is constructor from this XML file I am going to create one more bean I just copy and paste here in place of car I say bike in place of car class I say bike and just I remove this one in place of property I use constructor constructor arc and here I use value and in the name value I give uh, like Honda shine like this once again I use one more property constructor arg value equal to I say the model is 2020 like this remember that here we are providing a property and we are initializing here the setter these functions here and from this properties setter getter I am just creating an object here I am initializing the constructor because in bike class I have created a constructor and I am passing the value in constructor and then I am creating an object and using this so for that again what I have to do I have to use the vehicle also here I say b1 and I say context one dot get beans and here I say bike and I say class bike dot class like this and I call the b1 dot info and I save it and remember that I will have the information of this one Honda shine and the model 2020 and we have the output here like this we have the same and you see that first one is coming from the setter injection second one is coming from the constructor injection so this concept which we have implemented we are creating an object by using the setter injection this is setter injection and this is the constructor injection you see nothing special is there uh, and we do not have a uh, any hard concept of this we have a very simple uh, the concept we are using xml tag and very just easily very without any uh, headache or without any bother and without just giving a lot of concentration that is spring spring so easily we are creating an object we are not making it complicated I am just making it very easy to understand that uh, this is this is this only this concept to uh, you pass the value uh, using property uh, to the class and the pass the value uh, to the constructor tag to the constructor in a class this concept is called setter injection and constructor injection so this is called setter injection and this is called constructor injection and very simply we have executed this concept and we have the value also and you see that in this video in this video uh, we have learned how we can use xml uh, file for all these things but uh, can we remove this bean tag also yeah we can remove bean tag also but how we can remove uh, i will explain you in next video that how you can remove these bean tag and still you can achieve the uh, setter injection and constructor injection uh, without the bean tag so i will explain in next video so if you really like this video uh, kindly do subscribe my channel and thank you for watching my video